Hey everyone, Matthew's Fabrication here. Uh, you probably wonder why I'm doing all these short videos or random videos or whatever. Well, I've always been random and fabricating stuff or whatever. So, uh, our cheese uh, slicer broke the other day. I've had it for years and love it. Um, but just going to show you how to fix it. So, I already had some of this uh, safety lock wire stainless steel uh, that I made uh, some fishing jigs stuff with. And so I got a piece out here and it looks like it's a little over six inches. Uh, this thing is only like four and three quarter inches. So you probably only need like a five and a half inch piece or so. But I want to cut it. You need a screwdriver to tighten. Um, on this there's like a little ledge. So you can probably use that ledge. This is the first time I've ever made or done this. You can use that ledge, use your finger, and kind of bend around. And hopefully it doesn't twist on you. But just get it wrapped around a little bit. And if you had some pliers or something, it would probably be better. But let's see. Working around the camera. And it looks like I probably should have went the other way because if I tighten that way, that's going to want to pull out. So let's put it on like this. A little flimsy. So looks like I got to trim off a little bit of that and then you just run it through that little notch on the top like that pull it up and over and then let's see so I went to the right so probably want to go to the right so I just pulled that up and around that pulled a lot easier And then it wanted to come out just a little bit, so I'm going to push it back in, hold it with that finger. And it's a little loose, so you can probably uh, mess with that and tighten it up, but pretty much there you go. And you can use this to adjust your thickness of your cheese. Um, definitely probably want to pull that tight, so I'd probably recommend grabbing uh, some pliers or whatever. So I'm going to do that and see how we are. Okay, I'm back. So I took uh, these things that help you make uh, circles with, and I just uh, pulled tight. It would focus. I pulled tight around there, and then... When I did that, it also tightened up the top a little bit more. And then I loosened this one, just so I could show you. But I probably need to cut it just a little bit more. So I had six and a half, so I'm cutting off maybe three eighths. So about like that. So if you take this and you kind of pull around that screw, and then just wrap it up and under that screw like that. And so you want it to wrap around the rotation where you're turning. And then take it and screw it down, which should help tighten it. There you go. That looks like a lot tight. Oh yeah, it's a lot tighter. So there you go. That's how you fix your... Uh, cheese slicer um, stainless steel wire so it doesn't rust and kind of wrap it around there get it nice and tight in each uh, screw well that one's sticking out just a little bit I could press that back in but but there you go you get the get the idea of how to fix it thanks for watching please like subscribe and comment below and just trying to grow my channel so thanks again